balance for me means equality between men and women, uh, whether this letter concerns sports, politics, employment, salaries, anything that has to do with the equality between men and women, and for better well, meaning that certain improvements that will affect women will make the world a better place and will make the world a more equal place between men and women. Everyone has a part to play. This balance should be carried out throughout, not just as the International Women's Day 2019 campaign theme. We all should stand for uh, diversity and own your power. You can make a difference, create change, uh, base your standards on what you think, not just what others tell you to think. Balance for better would be better because there is still so much inequality even in our society. A lot of domestic violence and you know, inequality in the pay rates between men and women. So, And women have got a lot to say now and in this country we can. If women were in Parliament and you know helping make the rules that it would be a better society for all. When a woman is becoming herself, she will face the pressure from her culture. Um, I came to Australia for my bachelor five years ago. Everyone think that I was crazy because I studied one and a half a year in China. After graduate, I think that I will go to America, UK or Hong Kong for a master and then I will come back to China to find a good job, get a good husband and have my own family. That's my life. That's what the society expects me to do. But suddenly I feel sad that I can see my life next to five or ten years. So I need more possibilities and opportunities. So that's why I come here. I've got friends from my undergraduate course, all of them are Chinese. I've got some of them already have kids and so sometimes when I talk to them or when in a group chat, people will start saying, oh, hey, you need to grab a boyfriend soon, you need to grab a husband before you're getting too old. Because apparently girls get judged by their age, by their appearance, whereas men don't normally get too worried about getting old and being single makes me doubt my self-worth. Now I'm single, I don't have kids. Does it make me worthless? Does it make me not as worthwhile as men of my age who are also single and not a dad? Definitely makes it hard for me to be comfortable with myself, with my single life and with me pursuing my career. My culture in Korea has some old parts from the tradition. Women were treated less than men. The traditional concept and perspective have limited women to achieve what they wished. However, the old tradition is slowly fading with the new shift of generations. The later generation will be treated equally with diversion of ideas. Our time is now at the process of shifting. Some of the old tradition is still remaining with the elders. However, let's not hate them for what they believe. I know it is not being fair, but they are our family and some of cherished ones. It is easy to hate when being treated differently. Stay strong and fight to earn your rights. I realise in Australia, in our Western culture, we do try to make a difference. There's women in positions of power and like me, I'm grandma and I can come back to school and we can kind of do what we want. And to women from other countries where they're more oppressed or don't have as many freedoms, we probably seem like we have a lot of freedoms in our country. I think we've still got a long way to go. There is still that underlying inequality and domestic violence like that, yeah. It shows that women aren't treasured enough as they should be, even in our culture. There's a long way to go. So what I would like to say to girls out there, be yourself, you are an individual person, you are as worthy as a man, as any other human being out there. If you want to pursue a path that is different from what is traditionally or culturally expected, that's completely fine, just do yourself, you only live once, don't restrict yourself. On the legal side, we should probably pass more bills in the entire world to establish this sort of equality between men and women. Second, I think that even if this battle only concerns women, men should also play a role in this fight. It would make the changes easier and everything would happen a lot faster. I hope that each girl has the courage to explore who you are, to see how big the world it is, and to become who you really want to be. It's not easy as always, but we need to learn how to dance in the ring. Mm -hmm.